The big Shamrock Marathon weekend is making a comeback this year, but on a much smaller scale. Organizers had to be careful this year with COVID-19 safety in mind. And Sprocko takes us to the boardwalk to tell us what we can expect this weekend. <laughs> The Virginia Beach just opens up because it really is a celebration. It's a celebration now set to look a lot different for the Shamrock Marathon weekend this year. Co-organizer Jerry Frostick says last year was difficult when they had to quickly cancel the big event while so close to the finish line. It was a major round hook that knocked us out. Frostick says instead of 30,000 people joining for one exciting race this year, it's going to be a smaller number of people and more spread out. There's about 5,500 people that stayed in for the 2021 event. Um, about 3,500 are doing it virtually. If you run virtually, Frostick says you'll still be running the same type of course and length. You can even track your other running mates to see where they are on the route. <laughs> Frostick says 2020's cancellation cost them a pretty penny and prevented them from donating to local charities. He says while a few thousand people doesn't compare to the almost 30,000 people they get every year, he believes they are running in the right direction. When you're coming from nothing, it's, it's a start. And I think that's what we're trying to really go with is instead of what we can't do, let's stay positive and this is what we can do. Frostick says any donation will help them set up for a much better 2022 race. In Virginia Beach, Anne Sparocco for 13 News Now.